Sometimes the backdrop to your meal is just as exciting as what you're eating, and these are eight of the greatest places that have truly unique locations. Vinny's at Night in Somerville is a restaurant that's actually housed in the back of a convenience store. And while you may not be convinced the food will be tasty as you walk past the racks of chips and sodas, with one bite, you'll know why this place has such a following. There's sweet and satisfying shrimp grand marnier, piping hot pasta al forno, and a massive veal osabuco served over risotto. And if you have room for dessert, try the fresh-filled cannoli or the homemade tiramisu. With locations at Loretta's Last Call on Lansdowne Street and this spot on Martha's Vineyard, Backdoor Donuts is a small bakery that cranks out hot, fresh donuts. And while you can visit the shop during the day, it's always fun to stop by in the evening when they're making them fresh and serving them hot out their own back door. Here we focus on late night donuts. It's not offered everywhere, but what's not to like about donuts? You know, it's fried, it's sugar, it's chocolate, it's, it's all the good stuff people love. They're fresh, but when you get a hot one, it melts in your mouth and there's really nothing else like it. Rico Panetteria is an Italian bakery located in the heart of Boston's North End, just down a narrow alleyway. Here they make loaf after loaf of fresh breads that are a feast for all the senses, all made by hand every day with a variety of flavors and fillings. This one is called the Miche. We have a small and large one. It's a French style sourdough. And then the Mountain is a whole wheat sourdough with fermented bulgur wheat, where people like that for sandwiches. Our most popular breads, I would say, are this one right here, which is a Kalamata olive and this is a prosciutto and parmesan. It's not something you will see almost anywhere, uh, people putting meat and cheese and bread, but it is uh, very good. I could walk down the street and eat a whole loaf of this no problem and uh, be satisfied. Just off I-495 in Marlboro, Apex Entertainment is a larger-than-life spot with more than 100,000 square feet of food and fun. It spans two floors, has multiple bars, and serves oversized comfort foods from jumbo pretzels to two-foot-long hot dogs. And when you're done putting back all of that goodness, go ride the go-karts, play some laser tag, hit the ropes course, or try one of their 30 interactive bowling lanes. Set on the third floor of Italy in Boston's Prudential Center, Terra is an attractive space with an active open kitchen, abundant greenery throughout, and a big open skylight that brings the outdoors inside. Here the menu is centered around a wood-burning grill, creating dish after dish of fire-kissed foods like stunning steaks and locally sourced seafood. And the pasta is as fresh as it gets and comes smothered in slow-simmered sauce full of flavor. Roxy's Arcade on Mass Ave in Central Square, Cambridge, is a massive arcade serving all the fun fare you grew up on. The space itself is sensory overload, packed with old-school video games, classic pinball machines, gourmet grilled cheeses, craft cocktails, and more nostalgia than you can imagine. I'm a child of the 80s. I grew up in arcades. I love video games to this day. So when you walk in, a couple things you'll notice right away is on our ceiling we have this amazing grid system that really resembles a Pac-Man grid. So right away you get the feeling that you've hit an old school arcade. We've got two bars here. We've got about 30 arcade machines, half a dozen pinball machines, two skee-ball machines, a pop shot basketball, foosball, and as far as I know, the longest shuffleboard table in Boston at 18 feet. It's a great place to come and drink, come and play, and just sort of lose yourself in the moment. Built in 1935, the Clam Box in Ipswich has always been a beacon for lovers of fried seafood, beckoning anyone hungry for fried clams, lobster rolls, and an overloaded fisherman's platter, plus homemade coleslaw. And there's no mistaking this eatery as you approach it on Route 1A, because it's shaped like a massive clam box. Located just along Route 114 in Warwick, Rhode Island, the Treehouse Tavern and Bistro is a charming spot unlike any other restaurant you've ever seen. And that's because the owners created a truly unique space set inside an 1820s farmhouse with eclectic decor in every corner where you can feast on a menu lined with comfort food favorites. People can't believe their eyes when they come into the room. They scan the room in amazement from inside to outside. You can read it right on their face, either this wondrous look or smile and they scan the room, immediately we know they haven't been here and we gladly show them around to all the areas. They're some of the top unique restaurant locations Phantom has ever found. Only the best make it to the Great Eight.